Hi, if you're watching this video, you own a Sony Bravia internet-enabled television, and you're also subscribed to TELUS for your internet service, and they have provided you with an Action Tech router to provide wireless and wired connections to your internet devices in your household. And every time you try and connect your Bravia television to the internet, you keep getting local access failed and internet access failed. Well, I'm going to show you in this video how to set up some manual IP addresses so that way you can get it connected. So first please go to your Action Tech router and check to see what kind it is. It could be either Action Tech V1000 or Action Tech R1000. It will be important to write this down because I'm going to give you a set of IP addresses that you'll enter in manually in the television to get it connected. So please pause this video and go to your Action Tech router and find out if it is a V1000 or an R1000. So once you know which kind of Action Tech router you have, please just watch this video. I'm going to show you how to input those IP addresses manually and then you'll get your TV connected to the internet. Start by grabbing the Sony TV remote and press home and then look for the settings icon and then find the network. Inside the network, choose network setup and then go down to wireless setup if it's wireless, wired if it's going to be wired. If it's wireless, go to scan. It'll scan for your wireless network. Then find your wireless network. Put in the proper password. An arrow to the right. Now you're going to have a choice for auto or custom. Go down to custom and then choose manual for the IP address settings. You're going to go into the IP address and you're going to change it by going up to match the IP addresses that I gave you earlier in the video. When you're done entering one line, you just press the button in the middle of the arrows, go down to the next line, press the button in the middle of the arrows and then you can change those until you have all the IP address, subnet mask, default gateway, DNS primary, and DNS secondary exactly like the ones that you have written down at the start of this video. When you're done putting in all those addresses, just like the ones that you've written down, just arrow to the right. Do you want to use a proxy server? No. Arrow to the right. Summary, arrow to the right, and then just save and connect. As long as you put in the proper wireless password and then put in these manual IP addresses, you should then finally connect to your network with local access OK and internet OK. Now, just to finish up, I recommend that we update the firmware of the television. So you can just go return go up to product support software update and start the software update there's no versions excellent you can just go return again and finally I would recommend going back to network and then going down to refresh internet content this will load all your YouTube Netflix and Bravia Internet Video Services. So now that your internet content is all ready, let's go home and you can scroll over to internet content and there you got your Netflix, 3D Experience, Slacker, and then if you want to rent movies directly from Sony, brand new movies, you can go to the Sony Entertainment Network and get set up. I hope this video has helped you connect your Sony Bravia Internet TV to the Internet. Have yourself a good day, and thank you for choosing Sony.